guys welcome back to the channel so in this video as you can tell by the title it's the holiday time and I do this video every year you guys said you were interested in seeing it but it's my what I got everyone for Christmas video now if you have not checked out the what we got our four month old baby for Christmas video I'll link it down be below and I'll see if I can put an eye in the sky to that video as well because I'm not going to include her stuff in this video because I don't want this video to be super super duper long which is already going to be long because there's quite a bit of stuff in here that I need to show you guys if you see me looking over to uh, my left your right it's because baby girl is over there eating <laughs> and so I want to make sure the bottle doesn't fall out of her mouth but in today's video I'm going to show you everything that Ronnie and I purchased for all of the kids in our families and also our friends um, children um, we decided in my family this year that we we're doing secret Santa so there's only um, one adult gift per person so I'll go through those and tell you guys um, what that is as far as Ronnie and I as well but for the most part everything in this haul is going to be kid stuff because that's who we purchased for it this year so if you're interested in seeing what I got everyone keep watching this video is not in any way shape or form intended to be boastful or bragging or anything like that I like these videos again I'll say it again I like watching these videos because they give me ideas for the children in my life that I'm shopping for so I hope that's the reason that you enjoy the video as well but again don't interpret it the wrong way I'm not bragging or boasting or anything like that um so without further ado let's get into what I got everyone Okay, so what I decided to do this year was to print off different um, names and put piles together because I am one that will buy duplicates because I do start shopping for the Christmas season very, very early in the year. Um, sometimes as early as June, I'll pick up stuff that's on sale or clearance that I know I like for a particular kid and I'll just store it away. Well, by the time the Christmas holiday gets here, I've forgotten what I bought or I don't remember where I put it or anything. So I decided to make one room in the house kind of... Um, buttons Christmas workshop and I have everything laid out so that I can see what I have and I have everyone's name printed out as well so that I know what I got them and I know what I still need any names that don't have anything beside them that lets me know that I need to go and purchase something for that kid so I'm gonna start out with my niece Mia aka Mimi um, she is two years old and I decided um, to get her a few outfit ideas um, so I got her, this came from Marshalls and they had some really nice sets. I like the sets. I told you guys in the, what I got my baby for Christmas video, I make it easy on myself and easy on moms because in the morning when you're trying to get them out the door, ready and out the door, it's easy to grab an outfit that you already know has a complete set. So this is really cute. I actually got my other niece, Brooklyn, the same outfit so they can be twins, but it comes with a really nice like Aztec print legging. And then it comes with a long sleeve ruffle sleeve ivory shirt and then an army green vest so really pretty this was $19.99 at Marshall's I also got her this she's size 3t I got her this from Marshall's it was $16.99 and this is from the brand Tahari um the, this one was from Aspen Kids I like these brands they have the cutest stuff so this is actually um corduroy overalls and then it has like a really soft um shirt that has like a muted floral print on it and then the straps are ruffled so cute again this is 3t and this one was $16.99 she loves all things Minnie Mouse so I also got her this Minnie Mouse sweatsuit in pink so cute has a hoodie and of course it has a bow and the Minnie Mouse ears on it so that's for Mimi and then I was in Macy's backstage this was um how much was this at Marshall's I got it from Marshall's it was $14.99 from Marshalls. So not too bad. I was in Macy's backstage getting a couple toy gifts. And as I was walking to the register, I saw these fur coats for little girls. So I got her a 3T. It's Juicy Couture brand. And Macy's had them for $24.99 in her size. I know they were $19.99 in the smaller sizes. But 3T and up was $24.99, which was still really good because the compare at price was 70 bucks so those are the four apparel things that i got baby girl this year um and let's get into miss mimi's toys so um i got her an aerial styling head because she's into hair and like you know little cutesy makeup things and stuff like that so i figured she could do ariel's hair i thought that would be really cute um, I also got all the little girls pedicure sets and these pedicure sets I got these from oh this um 
I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to rush because I don't want baby girls to <laughs> start making noise. This style ahead came from Ross for $12.99, which was a good price because I think Target and Walmart had them, but they were $19.99. So I was happy to grab it from um, Ross. And then I got these pedicure sets for the girls, and they also come with an inflatable foot spa bath, which I thought was really cute. These came from Macy's Backstage, and they were $11.99. So I picked that up for them, and Mimi's into all things nail polish and stuff like that. This, um, a few months ago, we were at my parents' house, and she saw this online and said, but, but buy this for me. So I went ahead and ordered it. I'm pretty sure she's forgotten about it by now because it was over, you know, a couple months ago. But I really did you know, add it to the cart and purchased it for her. This came from Walmart and I believe it was um, 12 or 14.99. Um, I also bought her this set and I was gonna buy her a, um, individual stuff from Target, but I found this set and it was a better deal and it came with more for cheaper. So this is the perfectly cute um, deluxe nursery set and it comes with the crib, um, a chair stand, a carrier, a jogger stroller, and this also becomes a feeding chair, a carrier, a swing, and a high chair. And then, of course, it came with the stroller. My sister is purchasing her a doll. And y'all, Mimi swears she's somebody's mom. So I think she's really going to like this. This came from Marshalls, and it was $22.99. So I thought that was a good price. Um, and then her other big gift, um, I saw these this online a couple months ago. And I waited for it to come back in stock. And it was on sale as well. I purchased it from Walmart. I believe I paid... $50 for it um but it was the sale price anyway um and it is a huffy um six volt battery powered scooter but it blows bubbles out of the back as you ride it and Mimi is the bubble queen so I thought this would be really nice and I got her the Disney princess version there were some other um versions as well I know there was a Paw Patrol one I think there was a Disney Cars one as well um but of course I got baby girl the uh Disney princess one and um, it says it includes bubbles, but I'm pretty sure it's like a trial size bubble that's not going to last. So I did, I was in Dollar Tree last week. I did pick up another refill of bubbles for her. Um, and then of course, Auntie Bubba wants her to be safe. So I got her the matching elbow and knee pads and also a helmet, um, for when she rides outside. So that is the stuff that I got from Miss Mimi. Um, and let's move on. So I think the easiest thing for me to do is kind of move around the room because stuff is pretty much everywhere. So, um, oh, baby girl is being really quiet, you guys. So let me move you guys over a little bit because now I am going to do my nephew Ace, okay? Um, so I got him some apparel items. I got him this Carter's um, outfit. Really, really cute, really casual. It came from Ross. I got it in 20 four month size um I think he's between 24 months and 2t so it should work out and it was only $9.99 but it was so cute look at the um the dinosaurs on it and I like the casual pants so I picked that up for him I also got him a sleeper a footed sleeper you can't have enough of these this is the Carter's brand and it has the fire truck on it and this was only $6.99 which was a great price and this was again 24 months and then in the size 2t I got him a Nike sweatsuit I really like it on the back it says Nike Air and it's um, red white and black I got this from Ross as well and it was $24.99 in size 2t so not that bad at all those are the three apparel items that I got for Mr. Ace um, and let's get into some of his toys now I did find this baby shark he loves baby shark so I got this baby shark water activated um, bath toy and basically when you put it in the bathtub and it hits the water it starts swimming around and singing the baby shark song and this was $9.99 at Ross so I grabbed this for him in the blue color they did have the pink and the yellow as well and then my brother loves to work out so I thought this was the cutest gift to get for his son it is the Fisher Price uh, Counting Reps Dumbbell and it's a laugh and learn of course six to 36 months um, Ace is one and a half so this says it teaches counting opposites and healthy habits and it's a it's a dumbbell how cute is that so i got this for him um i think i got this from kohl's because i had kohl's cash um so i think i only paid one or two dollars for this once i put my five dollars kohl's cash towards this but i got this months ago and i think it was like originally 9.99 um i also got him this fisher price uh little people choo choo zoo train and when you press down on the back of the um 
wagon here it plays a jungle sound it comes with you know a person and then some animals i got this from ross it says ages one to five so it's appropriate and it also says um taking them places learning their sounds and it teaches you you know caring for animals and this was from ross for 11.99 so i picked this up for ace man as well i also picked up a drum set for mr ace man from walmart i believe this drum set was $19.99 I believe um and it's from the kid connection brand I got him the blue one it comes with the seat as well again he's only one so I didn't want to get him a real drum set just yet because he's a little small so I'll see how he does with this one first um and I know his sister has a similar one as well so this I think was again $19.99 at walmart.com I got him that and then this I picked up from Walmart months ago um, I follow a lot of couponing and deal sites on Instagram and someone posted this months ago and it's been stored away at my house um, and at my previous home for a very long time but I got him the plush ride-on six volt um, chase from Paw Patrol and I think this was like 70 some dollars originally and I got it for 30 bucks um, so again, it's plush, it's six volt, it's ride on, it's electronic. I thought it was really cute. I've never seen the plush ones. I buy the, um, small little six volt ATVs for all of the kids all the time, but I've never seen the plush one. So I went ahead and I got it for him and it is super cute. So those are the items that we got for Mr. Ace Man. Moving on to my niece, Brooklyn. Brooklyn is literally um like two months younger than ace so they're in the same age range and um i decided to purchase her a uh large kitchen set because she didn't have one at my parents house so or have one at all um so i will insert a picture of the disney princess kitchen set that i got her from target it was 129.99 but i had a 25 percent off coupon so it took off like 30 some dollars I believe which was really good so I made it like $99 when I bought it so that was her large toy item um out of her budget but I also got her some clothes so let me grab those okay and here is her name you know Brooke her name is Brooklyn though I got her this outfit because it's so cute and Brooklyn is my niece that passes all her clothes down to baby girl Reagan so I thought this was so cute look at the trench coat y'all this is by the brand Tahari again it's a three-piece um, outfit so cute it's 18 months so hopefully she can fit this and I got this from Marshall's for $19.99 and this is great because you get like a springtime jacket as well and then you get an outfit so that was good and then again I told you guys that I got her the same outfit that I got for my niece Nia as well so again this was $16.99 from the brand Aspen Kids at Marshall's so that's for Brooklyn and again I'm trying to get through this pretty fast because <laughs> um baby girl is right here and I don't want her to turn up okay so moving on for um my oh let me let me insert the picture of the kitchen set because I didn't do that okay so moving on to my little cousin Bentley, who um, is seven years old now. So he is into all things Fortnite. He loves playing the PlayStation 4 and playing the game Fortnite. So I found a Fortnite gaming chair online. I sent him a video and asked him was he interested and he said of course. So I ordered him that. Let me tell y'all the story behind the Fortnite chair. Okay, um, Target had them and they sold out walmart had them they sold out um so i ordered it directly from the manufacturer which is respawn r-e-s-p-a-w-n and surprisingly they had it on sale everybody else was charging like double the price but it was like 113 that i got the chair for and i was so excited it was brand new it was the one that reclined it had the footrest and everything because there's two versions but that one is the more expensive version so i got it for like 113 and everybody else was selling it for like two hundred dollars well a week later they emailed me and canceled my order because they said they didn't have it in stock why did you allow me to order it you know so i was already annoyed because it had been a week so then i get on ebay because all the other retailers are sold out and i've 
I was dealing with private sellers on eBay. I ordered it from a private seller again and a week later he cancels my order. And of course, by this time I had paid $2.25 for it because it had been a week and the demand was higher. So I went from paying $1.13 to $2.25, but I didn't get Bentley anything, or we didn't get Bentley anything for his birthday, which was in October. So I was like, this is a joint gift. Okay, I'll pay a little more. So I ordered it from the first seller on eBay for $2.25, and a week later they canceled my order. So now I'm really upset. And I contact the seller, like, hey, I paid in full as soon as I purchased it. What happened? It's been a week. You haven't shipped it. Like, you canceled my order what's going on? And he was like, Oh, well, we went to go ship the item to you. And we realized it was the last one in stock and it was damaged. So I'm like, really annoyed. And then on top of that, it took like 10 days for them to get me a refund. So before I couldn't wait another 10 days, right? Because now it's been two weeks that I've been waiting on the chair. So I went to another eBay seller and I messaged them before I purchased it like, Hey, can you check your inventory and make sure you have this in stock and ready to ship? Um, and they got back to me and they said they did. But of course, by now, the price went up again. So now we're up to $275. And I was just like, I, I really don't want to pay this money, even though it's a joint birthday and Christmas gift. I really don't want to pay that amount. But because I had already promised him the chair, I do not like not keeping my promises to children. So I went ahead and ordered the chair. I ordered it on December 8th. I paid in full. And she shipped it on December 8th. Or maybe I ordered it on December 7th. Either way, she shipped it on December 8th with the U.S. Postal Service. Y'all, why is it December the 21st today and I still don't have my package and the status has not been updated since December 12th and all it says is your package is arriving late and it's in transit to the next facility. She, I have contacted her twice and she has went to the post office in her local area and they are just basically blaming COVID and you know, the holiday restrictions. But if you pay for a tracking and you pay to have something by a certain date, um, you should honor that and if you're not able to honor it, you shouldn't offer that because you've collected my money US Postal Service and My package was supposed to be here no later than the 14th It is the 21st and nobody knows where my package is It's not even updated in the system as far as tracking and this is a Christmas gift for a kid So I'm really annoyed, but I will insert a picture of the chair that I got for Bentley for Christmas. I'm not sure when it's going to get here. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping it'll be here by Christmas this Friday, but um, or Christmas Eve on Thursday. But if it isn't, all I can tell him is it's coming at some point because they weren't able to give the seller any updated information. So I don't know. That's Bentley. I'll insert a picture of the chair now. Okay, moving on to Bentley's little sister, Eva, who is also the same age as my niece, Mia. They are two years old. Sorry, baby girl, it's right here. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Hi. Hi. She's laughing. <laughs> Hi. Hi, baby love. Hi. Hold on, let me get her her toy. <laughs> you want Mr. Payne? So if you guys hear crackling, it's her penguin toy. Sorry about that. So Eva, like I said, is the first, the same age as my niece Mia. They're both two and a half. Um, so I got Mia the Ariel styling head. I got Eva the Elsa styling head. Again, it was $12.99 at Ross. And then I also got her the same pedicure set because, again, I figured the ladies could do pedicures while they're here over the Christmas break. So that is for my niece Eva. Moving along to our nephew Josiah, he loves all things sliding boards and he thinks Ronnie is his human slide. So we got him the same sliding board that we bought for Baby Girl's Playroom. I'll insert a picture of it now. Okay, and that slide was, I think we got it on sale for like $21.99 or $22 or something from Amazon um, a couple of months ago. And we just had them. We purchased his the same time we bought the one for the playroom and we just kept his. Um, here is his name. And then he loves all things dinosaurs. So we got him a remote controlled dinosaur. This came from Ross for $18.99. It roars, it walks, it talks, and then you can use the remote control. So we got him that. 
And then the last thing we got him is he loves sports. So I found this at Ross as well. It was $7.99 and it's the Little Tykes brand. As you know, I really like getting brands that are tried and true and trusted. If you watched the What We Got Baby Girl for Christmas um, video, you saw I got Fisher Price, Little Tykes, and VTech for the most part. So we got this Little Tykes. It's called Clearly Sports Golf Set and it was $7.99. It comes with three balls and um, yeah, it's a push to release system. So we thought this would be cute for him. So we got him those three things and that is for Josiah. Moving along to Josiah's older brother. You guys know him, Joshi, or AKA, AKA Joshua. I call him Joshi. But we got him a few things as well. Let me turn the camera a little bit. Here's his name. Um, so I picked this up at, <laughs> earlier in the year from, I believe I got it from TJ Maxx. Yes, it was $19.99, and it is a sports freestanding boxing set. So this one, um, you can put air or whatever in the bottom it has an air pump and it has like the speed bag boxing and some boxing gloves so i thought this was really cute for him again it was 19.99 and joshua i believe is eight okay and then i also purchased this a long time ago but he's into um just cool like discovery stuff as well so i got him this discovery um super stink lab it's a stem toy and this was um, at TJ Maxx for $14.99, but I actually got it on clearance for $12 and it has everything in it to make different stink smells. So I thought he would think that's cool. And then his last gift is this one. And this is what I'm most excited about. I think he's going to really like it. It's a full size telescope with a full size, um, um, tripod included. Now this came from Macy's backstage and this was $19.99. So I thought this was a really really good brand again he is eight so i think he will really like it it's the vivitar brand stars and beyond and it is the 60x by 20x refractor telescope so we shall see for 20 dollars, i thought that was a good um amount for a little kid okay moving along i need to move you guys move the camera for you guys and show you josiah and joshi's sister skylar's stuff so let me move the camera Okay, guys, so Skylar is, I believe she's seven. She's only a year younger than Joshi, and she is into all things LOL, JoJo Siwa, all the girly, you know, little stuff like that. So here's her name, and let's get into what we got her. So at Macy's Backstage, they had a ton of JoJo Siwa stuff, so I thought this was the cutest thing. It's a double-sided light-up mirror, and I thought this was really cute because she likes to play in her kid makeup and stuff so she can have like a little vanity mirror. And it's Jojo Siwa, so it has the bows, you know, and it lights up. So I thought this was really, really cute. And it has 360 uh, rotation and it takes um, four AA batteries. So I got her that. And to go with that, I thought I got would get her a ceramic curling on that is also Jojo Siwa so her mom can do her hair and she can be looking in the mirror and you know they can just have a girl's day so I got this now the mirror at Macy's backstage was $9.99 and also the Jojo Siwa ceramic curling iron was also $9.99 they did have a curling wand as well and I thought about getting that but it didn't have a glove so I wasn't sure so I didn't want them to burn their hands, um, so I just went ahead and got the uh, ceramic curling arm because it has the clasp to hold the hair. But again, this was $9.99 as well. I also got her the same matching pedicure set. The pedicure set was $11.99 from Macy's Backstage. Again, it has the inflatable um, foot baths and all of these polishes and the loofah and everything, the files and toe separators and nail jewels and stuff like that. So I got her that. I also got her this LOL, baby girl is not happy. This LOL, um, what did I get her? LOL bracelet walkie talkies. Cause I thought her and my niece, they play together really well. So I thought they could play with this over the Christmas break. And these were $9.99 from Macy's Backstage. They do take um, batteries as well, but I think the batteries come inside of it, I hope. Okay, so I also, in Walmart, JoJo Siwa has a line. We also grabbed her some JoJo Siwa shoes. So these are really, really cute. They were $16.87. Some of their, her JoJo Siwa stuff at Walmart was on sale. Some of the shoes were like $12 or some change, but this particular one wasn't. Um, and yeah, so we got her these high tops and they were eight, uh, 
Uh, we also got her a JoJo Siwa flip sequin messenger bag. You know how little girls always try to, you know, take purses and bags and stuff. But this one you can actually design and decorate yourself. So I thought that was really cute. I found this at Macy's Backstage again for $9.99. Um, I found this at Ross. It's a JoJo Siwa keychain. But it also holds some um chapstick in the cupcake flavor lip balm so this was $1.99 at raw so i just you know threw it in her stuff and then the last thing we got her was it's basically an lol advent calendar um for 12 days but i'm just giving it to her as a gift and there's a ton of stuff in here it was from macy's backstage and i believe what is the price on this the price was uh, $9.99 as well. It says the box includes one headband, one charm necklace, one charm bracelet, one scrunchie, a keychain, a button, a tattoo sheet, one slap, one slap bracelet, two bows, one snap clip, and one brush. And they're all LOL themed. So I purchased that for Skylar. Okay, moving along. So you guys know I have um, a uh, group of best friends me let's see it's me ebony Brittany, and stacy and we're all moms now so we decided this year we were going to start a new tradition and we were going to have a holiday a hol i'm sorry a holiday get together gift exchange for our kids this year the theme is grinch so i'm going to go through and show you guys what we got each kid and we did have a 20 dollar maximum or 20 dollar limit your gift should be 20 dollars for each kid okay so um of course i have um baby girl and she is four months and then ebony has um Blake, who is nine, just turned nine, I believe. Um, Brittany has KJ, who is eight, I believe. I believe. Is he eight? Yes, I think he's eight. And she has Harris, who's three. And then Stacy has Harper, who's four. And then um, Brittany also has a niece that, you know, grew up with all of the kids as well. Her name's Erica. You guys saw her spa party. She's 11 now. So I'm going to go through those gifts and then... Um, I have two more gifts for my little cousins, and that's pretty much it for the kid gifts. So, for Brittany's son, Harris, again, he is three. Here's his little name tag. Um, we also, this year, decided, since we were doing the gift exchange with our friends, um, children, we put together a wish list for each kid of five items that we wouldn't mind our kids having, or our kids, if they're old enough to pick their own items, they wouldn't mind receiving. So, one of the gifts on Harris's... Um, wish list was this little tykes batter up um toys to tot sports t-ball set and this was um 19.99 at walmart so i went ahead and ordered it and i also the pink and purple version which is the girl version is usually more expensive because it's pink but it was on clearance for 9.99 so i went ahead and bought one as well this says it's for ages one and a half Plus, so I bought it for baby girl and I'll just give it to her for her first birthday, but it was only $9.99. This was $19.99, so I got that for Harris. Sorry, baby girl is talking up a storm over there. Um, Brittany's older son, KJ, um, he asked for a Lego set, so I got him this one. I thought this one was cool. He is all things Lego, and he's really, really good at doing Legos. So this is a 341 piece, and it is a three-in-one, so you can do different things with it. You can build a helicopter. Um, it has a tractor trailer. Um, you can do the tractor trailer with like the, uh, I don't know if that's a camper or what it is, but I thought it was cool because you can do the rocket ship. So this was, I think, $19.99, and I ordered this from, I want to say Amazon. And then for Blake, Ebony's son, he's the oldest. I think he's nine. He ordered. He asked for a specific Lego set. Um, he wanted the Fire Dragon one, so I ordered this. This one is 234 pieces, but it's also three in one, so you can make different things. Um, so I thought this was cute, and this was, I think it was like $18.99 or something like that. So, yeah, Legos come in small boxes, but they're normally not that cheap. Okay, so for Miss Harper, she actually lucked up. You know, Miss Harper is four. So I purchased her this. This was originally, I had no idea it was this huge. She asked for Barbie stuff, LOL stuff, you know, little little girl stuff. Um, I had no idea this was this huge. Um, but it was on clearance for, I think, $21. So it fit within the budget. So it is this 
huge Barbie set and it comes with the swimming pool it comes with two Barbies I actually liked it because it came with a male Barbie and a female Barbie all of these clothes and accessories and then it comes with the drop top convertible as well so this was on clearance at Target um, a few weeks ago and it was um, $21 so I had no idea when the box came out I was like what else did I order I thought I only ordered that but it was only that in the box is just a really large box but the car is pretty big itself obviously and it holds two of the Barbie so I think she will really like that and then let me grab Erica's gifts again she is 11 um, and here's her name so this was one of the things on her wish list it is the jelly res one-of-a-kind jelly design uh, rainbow jewelry and this is the super glitter set this came from Target um, I believe this was on sale for $12.99. So I picked this up for her and basically you mix it, you mold it, and then you can wear it. So it comes with everything you need. I don't know what it is. It was on her wish list. So I got it. And then to make up for the difference for her, um, I got this. This was $9.99 at Target. It's the Crazy Art My Look brand, but you can make color changing lip gloss. So I thought that was appropriate for, you know, an 11 year old. It says eight plus. Um, and yeah, so this is what I got for Erica, those two things. And our Grinch party holiday gift exchange is going to be Wednesday, the day before Christmas Eve. Okay, two more gifts. So I don't have a name tag for them because I ran out of paper and then I never reloaded the paper. But for my little cousin Marley, um, my cousin Courtney's son, she said he asked for a lot of Nerf guns and he has a lot of Nerf guns for Christmas as well. So she told me to see if I could find him a Nerf target because she was tired of him just shooting random stuff. So I got him this digital target. This is a bullseye digital target. Um, I ordered this from walmart and it was 19.99 and it's the nerf brand it says eight plus marley is four no he's five um but he's pretty advanced and he's really good at nerf guns so i thought this digital bullseye target has the swinging targets and everything it keeps your score so i thought this was good for him and again this came from walmart it was 19.99 and then um my little cousin christian who's also 11 he's super advanced i asked him what he wanted he asked for a drone so um my sister-in-law tia sent me a link and said that these were on sale from I am at Walmart, so I ordered this. I think this was $29.99. I want to say it was $29.99. It says ages 14, but again, he's super advanced. He'll be fine. And this one also has the, um, you know, remote that you can hook up a smartphone to. It has a camera on it. It has a Wi-Fi camera, and I picked the green color, but it did come in red and black as well. And again, this was Walmart, $29.99. It was on sale, marked down from like $50. And... um you know walmart does two-day shipping so both of these things came in two days you can't beat it okay so the things that you don't see um i actually pulled my brother's name for secret santa and one of the things on his wish list we did a wish list as well for the adults was some joggers so i ordered him some nike joggers from the nike website and they are delayed i think they're going to come tomorrow by the 22nd but i will insert a picture of the joggers that i purchased for him um, we had a 50 dollars limit Baby girl's over there talking so much. <laughs> we had a $50 limit. Um, and so I hit that right on the nose. Um, and they were actually on sale as well. So I got him the black pair. And I'll insert a picture. And hopefully they'll come soon. And then finally, Ronnie pulled my dad's name. And one of the things on his list was um, vodka. So we got him the Holiday Grey Goose Vodka set that comes with a large bottle of vodka. And then I think it comes with two glasses as well. Well, and that was around the $50 price range as well. Okay guys, so that's everything that we purchased um, everyone for Christmas this year. Um, like I said, I needed to get this video out. I'm sorry to rush it, but I have to wrap all of this stuff. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope it gave you some last minute ideas if you're still shopping for a little one. Um, let me know if you liked the video down below and I will see you guys in the next one.